In this quick video, I'm going to show you how to use the ride symbol mid samples uh, to overcome a problem that is pretty common with loops that start on the downbeat. Um, I'm going to play you just a quick, very short example of a ride symbol pattern with some comping and a fill, and then it goes to another ride symbol. And you're going to hear the problem. Let's check it out. So you see the the symbol crashed and then the ride symbol started right on the beat. Let's listen to the just the fill into that and you'll hear the the crash and then the symbol start right on the downbeat and it sounds very unnatural. So you wouldn't normally do that. You would hit the crash and then take a moment and then come back in uh, swinging. So this these here are the ride symbols. And what we've built in is that if you turn the velocity all the way up, so the loudest velocities don't start on the downbeat. They start either on beat two or beat three, depending on the tempo. So let's listen to how that sounds. So you hear the time keeps going, um, but there's just a little pause after the crash before he comes in. And we used a sample where the ride symbol was already kind of going a bit. So you can hear the crash happens and then the symbols just continues on. One more time. Thanks for watching.